Getting a new iPod is one of the most exciting purchases you'll ever make. If you've received one as a gift, that is even luckier. Learning how to work your iPod is another matter altogether. If you're unfamiliar with how this machine works, you'll want to learn all you can about iPod instructions. Thankfully, many people find it very intuitive to use an iPod. Apple has gone out of their way to make something that is very user-friendly. That is probably why the iPod has taken off to become one of the hottest selling items around. Still, no matter how simple the design, it's not easy to figure out how to work an electronic if you don't have instructions on how to do so. Following simple steps will lead you to be an iPod Pro in no time at all. The first thing you'll need to do is to download iTunes from Apple.com. iTunes is the software that Apple uses for you to be able to buy and store music for your computer and iPod. Make sure that you have the latest version so that your new iPod will be compatible. The next step in your iPod instructions is to collect the music you'll want to put on your iPod. This can come from your own CD collection, music you buy from iTunes, or other MP3 music that you import from other places, into your iTunes software. Then, you'll connect your iPod to your PC or Mac computer. Presto! It will automatically connect and sync to your iTunes music. Once you give it the go-ahead, this is probably everyone's favorite part of using their new iPod. It is so simplistic, because so much of the process is automated. Of course, you're not stuck with this automatic installation, if you'd rather not do it that way. You can go into your options and select manual. This will allow you to specify which things should and should not get transferred over. When you are finished downloading your music, you can select to eject your iPod from your computer. This is the safest way to unplug the iPod because information can get damaged if you are not careful. You might be concerned that you can only play music on your new iPod. Thankfully, you can download music, movies, TV shows, and games. There are even membership sites dedicated to this cause. It is amazing what iPods can do these days. Do yourself a favor and play around with the functionality of your iPod. It is quite simple to use iPod instructions that will get you up and running in no time at all. As soon as you start using your iPod, you'll wonder how you ever lived without it.